Today we're going to be going over an Oracle exercise called Oracle Pricing Copy a Price List. Once we get to the Oracle site, what you want to put in for your username is Operations. Password is Welcome. Enter. Once Oracle goes through all its um, once Oracle goes through all its opening stages, what we want to do is go to Procurement. And then we'll want to find Order Management Super User Vision Operations USA. So you'll want to scroll down. Order Management Super Users Vision Operations. Once we select that and it pops open, what you'll want to do is find Purchasing under that item. Here we go. Select Purchasing. Then under Purchasing, we'll want to look for Advanced Advanced Pricing. Here we go. Under Advanced Pricing now, we want to look under Priceless, Priceless Setup. Oh, sorry, price list, copy price list. Here we go. Takes a little time to open up, still waiting. Here we go. Once the copy price list pops up, what we'll want to do is in price list, we'll move this over and I'll show you in a little bit why we're moving it over. Uh, under price list, we want to write corporate. Under currency, you want to put US dollars. Uh, description pops up and populates because I've already done the, the exercise and so. I'll have additional um, populations on the items. So under price list, you want to put your XX code, and in this case, I'm going to put uh, I'm going to put XZ, and then we'll want to type in new corporate. Okay, you want to make sure include discounts and retain effective dates from copy from is checked. After that, you'll want to put in the description, my prices. Effective date. What you want to do here is go two months ahead. So we'll click it twice, get to January, select OK. Once we've gone here, you want to hit submit. And I got this note popping up once again because I've already done the exercise. So in my case, I'll be selecting OK. And once you hit submit, you'll get a request ID number. This is, uh, this is important. You want to write it down so that you have it somewhere. Okay, from here, you then want to go to view, request. And this is to confirm the request ID. Here we'll do specific request. Type in that number you have written down. And in this case, I moved over the box so that we could see the number. Okay, you'll want to say find. Click find. And here we go. Once you go to the phase portion, you'll see that it is completed. From here, you'll want to exit, exit out of request. Okay, and with this, we've now completed a price, copy to price list. Next, you'll want to exit out of here, and we want to verify the new price list has been actually created. So what we'll want to do is you'll want to exit the Oracle application. Select OK. 
and what we want to do is get back to our vision computer. From here, what you want to do is you want to scroll down to price list, price list setup. Here we go. Price list, price list setup. Select it. And again, we're going over this just to confirm that our price list was indeed created. Okay, once we get here. Okay, so once your advanced pricing price list box pops up, what you'll want to do is you want to come scroll up to the top where the flashlight is, select it, select your XX code, which in my case was XZ. So you'll put in your two, um, two letter word, also follow that with a percent sign select find and once you see your, that your um, your code is highlighted select OK and you'll see all the items populate uh, and with that we are we have completed and we did confirm that our price list was indeed created thank you